come back to another sit down and eat with me I am having a sugar apple we in the Caribbean I'm sure in other countries as well would know what this is some countries might have different name for it but we would call this a sugar apple in in the Caribbean so I try to get all dogs up try to press out all the curls from my hair right try to get a straight something straight and it just by the time I was finished flat ironing out this hair and I decided to take a bath and come do this but it dry and it is just getting back it's it just frizzy in other words you know it's frizzy would I attempt this again no look at it so I'm not gonna start all over go and do it all over again and then start this because I just want to eat this nice little fruit with you it's August 3rd and this is my breakfast this morning so let's get into this sugar apple so you won't see this on August 3rd you would see this after the I almost died chit chat video so that video would be aired on the on the fifth that is two days from now and the following wednesday is when you're going to see this mukbang it's already ripe so i didn't want it to waste so i said let me make a video decide to take a flat iron to straighten out my hair and by the time i was done getting ready it is all frizzy frizzy up frizzy up frizzy up so i'm not gonna do it all over again so all right so in case you have never seen a sugar apple this is what it looks like let me just show you what it looks like inside. So that's what it looks like inside. And I'm going to actually pre-plant this. This is the one of the only fruits that I really don't have in my yard. So um, I am going to plant this. So that, this is normally very, very, very sweet. Very, very sweet. So let's give it a taste. Never disappointing. Never disappointing. So I hope you all are having an awesome day. Mm. I hope you are enjoying my chit chat video. I hope you got a chance to watch my video that will be airing tomorrow, which is the fifth, because today is the third. And that would be how I almost died, literally. But you know, it's amazing when you trust God, how much you would keep you calm in the most awareness of situation. And the most unlikely things is what would be popping up in your head. Like the things that pop up in my head when I thought I was going to die. You'll have to watch that video on the 5th of August to see what I'm talking about. But trust in God was not an issue because I have faith. I am a praying person, so if I was going to die, the weirdest thing that was on my mind that day, it was so ridiculous. So you would have to watch that video and find out, and I know you're going to laugh. So that is what she was worried about. That is what she was worried about. Unbelievable. That is what she was worried about. So. <laughs> I don't have much to talk about today. More than. Oh, it's election time in Trinidad. So again, when you've seen this, is the 5th. So we have five more days before election time, which will be the 10th of August. So, two main party, the People's National Movement and the United National Congress. There's a small, other small little party, but insignificant to the other two major parties. They already make a big impression. They're not even a dot. 
Denn wir sind deshalb tot. So. Let's see who going to win this election. It's important to go out and vote, you know. It's your democratic right. Because when you choose to stay home and vote, you shouldn't be upset about nothing that is taking place in the country. Because you choose not to go and stay in your finger to the change that you would like to see coming. So, I hope people go out and vote. Yeah? So, let's see who's going to win. really sweet it's naturally sweet i have never eaten a sugar apple that isn't sweet and if you all have this fruit what 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 is the name of the fruit where you're from I'm gonna attempt to straighten out this here again. Oh, huh? oh, huh? just gonna wash it out, put some moisturizer, and and and, and leave my clothes alone. You know, cause this is working. It's working out for frizzy. Oh, so I feel warm. <laughs> so, have you checked out my patch flower? You can make so much different things with posh flour, especially porridge. And if you want to know a little more about me, don't forget to check out my Q&A. The links above. Mm. So, it's just very sweet, sweet, sweet um, fruit. I'm only going to eat half because it's really sweet. Uh, it's more sweet than the pop than the um, sour sap. That was so sweet that we ate. Pre Emancipation Day. Slavery was abolished in Trinidad in 1833. Um, that's why carnival. That's how carnival came about because of the slave slavery. And, but we have gone away from the real meaning of this carnival thing, you know. We have gone away from the real meaning and it's more like a naked thing. I mean, it's a great show. <coughs> but the meaning behind it is so powerful that people lost that meaning. And that is a sad thing though. It's really sad. So I'm only going to eat half because it's too sweet. And, um... I do hope you guys enjoy these little videos with me, these little sit down videos. I mean, if I can't be myself, what is the point, yeah? So, I am working on trying to use more makeup, as you all suggested in my q and I'm really trying. As I said, I'm going to go to my niece and I'm going to do a video on that, so bear with me. So, for my next chit chat, and I'm promising to, to, to press all this here again because it's looking so frizzy and so dry. I can't handle it. So, thank you for watching this little quick sit down. Just to share my little sugar apple food with you guys. And um, you all have an awesome Wednesday. And I'll see you again next week for another episode of Chocolate and Chit Chat. Thanks for watching. Bye. So I'm, I'm realizing it's too late. Hello and welcome back.